So guys, today in this episode, I'm going to show you how to use grapple hook like a pro question mark in Roblox. So the first step is to watch YouTube videos. So what you got to do is go to Google or whatever you use and you type in parkour how to sexiest grappler Roblox. I don't know if that's how you spell sexiest. But anyways, you watch and study all of these videos. And after you have studied all these videos and decide whether or not you want to uh, buy the grappler or not buy the grappler. But don't because you should wait until there's a sale in the game. And usually that's near Christmas or special events or events that have sales events because it's like a milestone. So that, like the creator feels nice and generous and like wants to give away or not to give away but like make stuff cheap and all that crap. And like, yeah, okay. So. After you have studied the videos, now I'm going to try and explain all of those moves that you learned or well you studied uh, in the video or haven't or you just learned from me because I'm legendary at explaining things. Right, so the first move in the grapple of thing, the, the thing to use grappler is the grapple. Now this technique is the second hardest because you don't need timing but at the same time you do need timing. Now this, as you see, I am using the, let me turn on my light. So as you see, I'm using the grappler to grapple on the ground. Now this technique is used so I can get around the map quickly. If there was a, uh, there's a speed comparison on YouTube. So if you watch that video, you can tell that grappling is faster, especially in third person because like your mouse can go where you want to grapple as you see. And then, okay, yeah, okay, I landed. All right. Now, after you learn how to grapple, which is the button you in, uh, you uh, put your use gear, so you go settings and then like you go key bindings and then you figure it out from there. After you do that stuff, you will now learn. Uh, you will now learn that you can grapple onto uh, buildings. Now, as you see, I just grappled on a building. Now, make sure you shift when you fall because if you didn't know, grapplers don't immune fall damage because it's still the same game. Because watch, I just broke my legs for this video. Yep. So the plan is to know how to time your shift when you fall now you don't always have to time your shift like let me let me okay okay I, that was just an example but so if i grappled up here i wouldn't have to shift because fall damage that is how they, that's the game all right the real thing the technique you want to learn after learning how to grapple from a wall from standing position and standing position grapple on the ground you will learn this jump so if you played the game, you will learn that you can click the middle mouse button and do like a lunge. Now that lunge is a very useful technique because you can get to far away places. So from here to there, I can make it with a grappler. See, I improvise there. All right, so from here to there, I can make it without the grappler. So this is just the lunge on its own. See that? Ooh, okay, I made it. I forgot to shift because I was focusing. I, was, I thought I was going to die. So now what you got to do, this is the hard part. So this is a weird timing. You can do it on any surface. It doesn't even have to be on the edge. You just have to have a wall that you can grapple on. And what you're going to do is you're going to do the same jump like that. The middle mouse button and the space button. And you're going to use E. So what you do is you press the middle mouse button and then E and then space. But you do a quick Lee because... I can't explain it, but okay, I didn't really do it there. It's because like I was, it was like a, it was like a, um, it was like a glitch. Like there was a little lag there. So yep. So what you got to do? Middle mouse. Okay, never mind. Never mind. It's not that order. It's not that order. Not that order. So the order is you press E, and as soon as you see the grapple line land on the building, you press middle mouse button and space, and the and the middle mouse button and the space should be done both at the same time. From my experience, both at the same time because. It would do this. See that? It just did that. So that's how you do it. You just do what I did. That is how I explain it. That is the best way to explain it. If you watch any other video that explains it after watching my and then you find my video, that is the best way to explain it. So what you do is you press E, wait for the line to land, and then and then middle mouse button, space button, uh, space bar, and then look. See, it just works. It didn't work there. You can tell it does like a. It does this thing. The animation. If you're on third person, it does that thing. It's like the superhero take off press e or the middle or whatever button for grappler and as soon as you see it land on the building you go to middle mouse button and space bar look at that it just did it again oh i thought i was gonna die all right that is the first move that is the easiest move that i know because that's the only move i use well except for like grab grappling now there's another move that comes after this 
Now this is the fourth, this is what makes grappling normally the second hardest move because it has this annoying thing called fall damage or grapple damage. Well, it's not really called that. I don't even think it's specified. But what basically what happens is if you're falling, you take fall damage. So like, and you grapple. So when you fall and you grapple, you take damage and you kill yourself because for some reason, if you hang yourself on one arm, your arm breaks, but not only does that happen, in Roblox terms, you die. What you got to do is when you grapple from a falling position, you got to shift. It's just basically rolling, but you wouldn't know when you land because you got to you got to time it. As I said, when the line hits the wall, you press shift. Well, I didn't say I didn't say that part, but like when the line hits the wall, you do something and then something. That is the game plan. That is what you need to learn. That is the hardest part. I haven't even got this the other move down, and this is the number one move well it's not the number one like you press the number it's the it's the hardest move well in my because i can't do it that is why so this is the uh, this is the uh legit thing so it's called fall cancel fall damage cancel cancel fall damage uh don't take damage when you grapple fall down to the building at the bottom so this is the move i can't do it though i didn't do it so basically you fall and then you like grapple and then and then my gear doesn't spawn in and then like basically when you fall you grapple and then it can't it does this it like cheats the the console thing i don't know if it's a get it look it just it's supposed to make it so i survived the it lagged that is why so i don't know how to explain this one but good luck because the real way this works for me is if i if I like focus focus like I like like it doesn't lag folks you probably have to get like a zip it lag you see that it keeps lag watch it's going to lag even when I jump what look at that I'm my game's lagging that's much smoother all right so now I can do this before so basically I think I'm moving from this area. It's this area. That is why. Oh my gosh, it's lagging when I'm moving my mouse. Uh, let's go to Vertex because that is the most familiar spot. All right. So, the fall cancel, damage cancel should be 18. 18. This, you can't get any better. So basically, that is the move that I cannot explain. You're just going to have to figure that move out. And yeah, it's really it. I don't know if it's still in the game or not because I haven't been able to get it at all no matter what I did after like a hundred million update and yeah so that is the move that I can never do and that is the move you're going to have to figure out even if it's not in the game you probably waste your time but it's basically uh it's basically the most perfected role in the whole universe now, there is there is a couple other moves but they're really weird moves so what this move is like the uh if i make it okay i made it uh yeah so it's like a die okay it doesn't it's because i'm lagging i'm playing on like 30 fps right now and i'm not even i'm dead so there's this move like it's like a bomb move so in a way it's a bomb. in my opinion it is like a bomb move i don't know what you call it but it's like it saves you time so like if you're a combo person this is the move it's you basically look at the ground and it pulls you down I'm pretty sure the only problems you can do, the only things that make, well, the only bad thing about that move is uh, the fall damage gets increased. I'm not sure. I might be lying though. So yeah, basically what you do is you do like a backflip, a backflip, and then you do like this, and then it pulls you down. But I'm not good at, I'm not, I don't use that move because I do this move. See that, that was like the, uh, no, I don't know what to try. Oh, right here. I'll do it right here. No, I failed. <laughs> No, 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 no. So, how? What? My middle mouse button's not. Okay, it it's processing four seconds after. All right. Yeah. So I had to do that. Yeah. So. Okay, that was my fault actually. I think you can. I think it is a good move. It just saves time. So like, if you're doing a combo. Okay, I might be so bad at rolling or something, or I just can't do it. So you just, yeah, you just look at the ground and it pulls you, and then you do that. And that makes you look like a pro because at the same time, you could do like a, you could do flips. That is what makes it look like a pro. So you do like a front flip and then, oh, and then you do like that. And then you do like that. And then you climb up here and then you do this. And then you 
grapple up here and then you do that. I forgot what that move's called and then you roll run and then you actually fake it because you didn't know what move you were planning to do. Then you do that and then you do like a back couple backflips and then you do this and then you're going to grapple onto the thing and then it's going okay. So it, I'm pretty sure the move cancels the uh the landing thing on the uh jumping mat things because the uh the uh the, uh, the and then you do that and then you're going to take oh new pro has arrived pretty sure the uh, grappler can hook on to other people but it doesn't it's not really like a crazy good hook on but you can like use players as the grap like you can grapple onto the player if you want to role play as batman in a parkour game why not